let's get back here that the the oven is starting to get cooler now guys because they gave us lots of heat but now since they want to cause some uh, some issues with flooding and everything they are the cold uh, shit will come and uh, and I have to shit I have to fix something before I start guys so not 30 seconds please but five minutes yeah, so you don't break my balls so uh, me horrible this camera I mean I am horrible but this camera enhances my horribleness uh, Galleria so before starting the all this shit guys I wanted to the barric barricade garage uh, uh, now heard my debunking you know and he's saying that uh, as I can see now my computer doesn't want to work <laughs> this shit so he said that uh, I'm right you know you cannot uh, survive just by having a garden of course shout out to Marcel Marcel Minge I don't know somebody made a video debunking me I like him though that's a cool dude. And he's up in the fucking mountains, apparently. That's biblical as shit. Remember that? Flee to the mountains. I like that. But no, people. Me showing you a garden. I'm going to tell you something. Lucy means Lucifer. I'm going to tell you something. I'm going somewhere. Me showing... So, guys, Lucy is saying that the video where he talks about me here is uh, is called Lucifer. Uh, Lucy, sorry, Lucy. So if you want to hear it all, I suggest it. It's, it's a good video. And I also suggest all his channel because, uh, you know, if the guy was uh, fishy, you know, he would have uh, at, uh, ignored at all uh, at my video. But but no, he's, uh, he did this uh, reply. Uh, so I suggest you his, his, his channel. I, I also watch his videos, so. Um, so he gave me mi ha dato ragione how do you say it? so he says that, that basically that I am right you cannot uh, just by having a garden you know you are fucking the system you know because you know it, it doesn't take just a garden to uh, to survive this shit guys I mean they can knock on, the, on your door they can do whatever they want with you so, and also, if you have a garden, you know, as I said, uh, all gardening that I'm, I'm doing here is like, uh, gives me food for like 5-10% you know, at maximum. And it, uh, also, after you have to consider that this is summer, so you have lots of uh, stuff that all the fruits are coming. You, know, you work during the winter and... Uh, and uh, how do you call it? spring and so it's, it's really the the only way to make this thing work guys is if uh, humans were smart enough to work all of us you know locally in a village for example we have to to do some central planning in my opinion like like for example the property that john have you know is good to grow this and so you know we decide you know it's not that you, uh, but in my opinion guys it's not even imposed superimposed because once for example you are uh, in an isolated place like let's say here in the mountain guys you are isolated from other towns you know and you want to survive basically with what your land and your animals can give to you what happened here just branches uh, or demons passing here around me <laughs> Uh, so you know you you have to to do some planning you know but this you know uh, pre presuppone how do you call how do you say presuppone you have to you know think that maybe you are uh, uh, you have reasonable people around you you know that are doing this thing otherwise you know if you have a psychopath guys I was seeing a video right now 
where they're talking about psychopaths, guys. And man, my father had all of the, those traits, and uh, and there's many of them. And and imagine also that now with the vaccine. So what I'm trying to say, guys, let's make this this shit short, is that uh, these are things that will never happen, guys. Because let's say that we have a village, you know, and we are all reasonable people that will do this uh, with our head, you know, will work and we survive with our 100% with our own efforts. They will not let, let you do this, guys. Just like they did with Waco, guys. They were given a good example how to be independent, how to be adults. And so they went them and they killed them. They burned alive babies, guys. There were people there. They they let them live as animals for 50 days, guys. In this uh, surge, how do you go? Yeah, there's this word. I can't find. That uh, basically they had to, to drink water from rain, guys. They would put buckets in their windows with the uh, uncertainty that they might get killed from the... the, the Pigs! The pigs around the house that were ordered to, to, to kill them with snipers. The moron doesn't know what, what he's doing, but he yet he, he will kill this uh, this person that he has no idea why. Because this, this is a sheep, guys. This is a, these serpents, guys. They will not let you do it, guys. So prepare. It's just a question of preparing. To die with honor, guys, at this point. If you want to dream like Daniel, you know, the guy that comments in my videos, but that, like Daniel, there are many more, you know. Keep dreaming that everything is going to be fine. Keep dreaming, man. I am depressed, uh, moron. Don't watch. And in fact, nobody watches my videos because they are very depressing. Who, who gives a fuck, man? I mean, so... Uh, and so, a garden, it's not, I mean, we have the means, guys, we have the possibility and everything, but unfortunately, this is not the right time and the right place to do this stuff, guys. Otherwise, I would have suggested you, like Barricade Garage was saying, you know, ah, oh, the garden is a solution. But now he realized and he is saying in this video that, no, it's not the solution. Me showing you the garden, that's the, like, those aren't answers. Like, the shit that's going on today... The best weapon you can have is your mental. All of, all of this, your mentality is going to determine your outcome. Set, somebody got upset. So, uh, so only on mentality. So he agrees with me on what what I just told you. You have to prepare mentally. You know, when it's time to say no, you will say no. You know, or the time will come. Yeah. Who knows how all this shit will go, guys? But. It was funny. He he called me Marshall Marshall Ninja. <laughs> I became a ninja guy. No, ninja. Uh, but I also slaughtered you know, his name in my video. So uh, so uh, now I, I wanted to go quickly through some quick shit of the vomiting stuff. Uh, from this clown world so here we have um, uh, killers heroes sorry uh, that say here no vax no party the killers guys also making fun of you the demons so here in Italy guys uh, more than 200 people but what they it's, this is what they say to us just drop dead in the street guys in uh, at sea you know in the beach everywhere people just drop dead and they say malore which is this general term to say that someone die of something that is unknown malore mal it's uh, malevolent mal bad re it's king Guess who did this bad thing to, to them, guys? You know, the virus, you know, Corona virus. The virus is the crown, guys. It's, they are just saying to you. <laughs> so, the, the title here says, The Summer of the 
the improviso, like uh, on on on, on uh, how do you say? Like you are not waiting for something. Oh, oh it just oh, it just happened. The deaths of this deaths. Of, all of a sudden, someone dies. I can't find the word, guys. Improvisa, improvisa. So, uh, oh no, uh, 221 just in 15 days, guys. Oh, I love him. Who knows how many people are dead, guys, but nobody numbers are, of course, since we live with these pigs here, guys, and the whores and the media and everything. And, and these other heroes here that kill you and make fun of you like this, you know. You know, you'll never see any uh, truth from this moment. And here they are uh, signing, telling the sheeple, uh, let's make a law so that we can get rid of old people. Yeah? Uh, people, for example, that uh, for some reason are incapable of uh, talking anymore, let's kill them. Why? They, they are wasting uh, oxygen. And so lots of morons in the street there sign yes I want to I want I want to be dead with the muzzle they are already trying to to kill themselves but but they also were signed yes kill me kill me and, uh, and here is a reptilian that has like a party or uh, we want to kill sheeple and we are giving them freedom by doing this you know they are selling this as as freedom and and here's the reptilians, you know, in the streets of uh, Italy, uh, trying to, to get as much uh, signatures from the sheeple so they can pass this uh, law. So, I mean, they are already killing us, guys, but you can see the reptilians, guys, and the morons, that because they wear the muzzle, guys. This is a sign that really tells you. And also they twist the language. They say... Sign here to live. Unbelievable, guys. Firma per vivere. Firma, sign, signature, to live. This is the opposite. This, they are talking about euthanasia, guys. Can you read here at the bottom here? Euthanasia. Sia legale. So there is a play on words that to be legal. Because sia is to be also. Free until the end, says this uh, shit. These are reptilians, guys. Death, they're selling death as, as, as life. Okay, so here we have other parts of the world that they agree on that because the morons are morons everywhere, guys. This one is in Spain, I guess. Uh, yes, yes, we want to die, yes. And they are trying to kill themselves with, by not breathing. Uh... Mi, mi vida es mia. My life is mine. You dumb more. They are slaves, guys. Total slaves. So, vivir es un derecho, no una obligación. So, to live is a right. It's not an obligation. <laughs> Amazing, guys. And one of these morons here, there in the street, guys, a possessed demon, you know, had this shirt on, guys. With serpents of of the dead, you know, since they accepted the offer of uh, of uh, the serpent, you know, they are dead, you know, and the eye of the tree, you know, the knowledge controlling them now. They are already dead, but they do not know it, you know. Amazing, and they choose this uh, this kind of shirts, guys, because they are fully possessed by demons, guys, which makes them choose, the, which makes fun of them, guys. This moron has no idea what he has put in his, in his body. Look at the moron, guys. Look, look how he cuts his his hairs. Look at this demon possessed this vessel, you know. Yo decido come, como y cuando morir. I decide when I want to die. Ah, you decide, you dumb sheep. So, uh, in uh, Great Britain. A great, great lodge, Great Britain. Uh, resting place, uh, last resting place of NHS founder, riser, Captain Sir Tom Reptilian. And you can see that he is a reptilian guy because he has not a cross, he has an obelisk. 
this is very telling if you have eyes to see and he of course even though he he he, he was like 120 years old he died of coronavirus of course yes of course and uh, here are the his his bodies are thanking him this this bodies here they are thanking him and let's see what uh, no I will not put my face with this demon uh, at the end of the day we shall be okay again the Sun Lucy Lucifer uh, will shine on you again and the clouds will go away captain sir Tom reptilian uh, shit. So uh, I want to do to talk about puppetry, guys. So as you can see here, guys, uh, in Albania, I I, rem I have some memories of Albania. Now now is the time to <laughs> to remember Albania when I was living in communism uh, in, in Albania, 80s until 90s. Then I came here in Italy. So I lived 11 years my first 11 years in Albania and then these other 30 years in uh, Italy, uh, Italy. Um, and I consider myself to be Albanian guys because uh, even by blood I'm uh, three quarters Albanian and one quarter uh, Italian and this Italian beat is of, of, of this demon possessed uh, father of mine so I will really and uh, for me, I have good memories of Albania, guys. Uh, even though, you know, it, it was slavery and everything, but when you are a child, you know, you think everything is fine because you don't see the shit, you know, you have no mind to see the shit going on, you know. It was shit uh, that also, guys, but uh, the memories were fine and uh, and overall it was a, a much saner society than what we have today. This one is really, really fucked up, guys. Really fake and everything. People were very... Okay, so why I'm talking about this people's artist? So I, I'm talking about the puppets, guys. So I'm, I'm talking about uh, the system that uses puppets, the, the sheeple themselves, to do things, of course, because they, they are like seal, a seal in the circus, guys. They are slaves, you know? You give them money and they will do whatever. Well, uh, you can also just threaten them you know, without even money. But no, they, they don't care. They just invented this piece of paper and it's good enough to control the sheep. So, it, it, look how they will use these uh, puppets in, uh, in Albania, guys. Let me see. So, get this. So, this, uh, this uh, prize that they would give to the sheep, uh, the puppets, by puppets, I mean actors, guys. And down here, here it says, yeah. So this thing, uh, so founded on whatever the honorary title, artist, artist of the people, bestowed upon singers, composers, orchestra directors, uh, musicians, uh, ballet dancers, and actors in theater. Blah 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 blah. Displayed great artist value, you know, they were good cocksuckers of the system of the reptilian towards the development of performing arts in the People's Socialist Republic of Albania. Now you can substitute without any problem a People's Socialist Republic of instead of Albania, you put your country because it is a socialist republic and of course of the sheeple peoples. So, in what this shit consists, well, first of all, guys, Albania is one of the few countries that just puts it in your face, the double-headed eagle, guys, you know, the Masonic double-headed eagle, as you can see here, amazing, and people's, sheeple's artist, with the pentagram also, and the sun, the rays there, you got it all there, guys. So... And so we would see, uh, for example, let's see, uh, I, I, I remember, for example, when we would see some movies in Albania, guys, which were all propaganda, of course, like today, uh, but, but it was even more uh, uh, like uh, 
uh, pathetic in, in Albania, guys, because it was just in your face, guys. At least today they would use some art and some sh complexities, but you can the the, uh, the juice of that, you know, the the core we know is propaganda. But there in in Albania, guys, they will not even hide. They will just ah, oh, our president, uh, you know, our dictator, ah, oh, you are so good, ah. Oh. <laughs> you know, they would sing song like this, guys, amazing. And so, and and then at the end of a movie, for example, we would see the names of the actors, of the horse, you know, of the puppets, and from time to time we would you would see this at the bottom of the name of, of some uh, of some actor or artist, you would see the sign "Artist Ipopulit." This one here, "Artist Ipopulit," Sheeple's artist. So it's not they are not the, the the systems artists, but it's the sheeples artists. And in fact, in Albania, guys, even the the main uh, newspaper was called Zuri Populi, which means the voice of the sheeple. I mean, it, it was not the, the voice of propaganda and everything. It was called the voice of the sheeple. Guys. I'm twisting the words, you know, just like 1984, guys. Just watch that uh, movie, and uh, and of course today the media and the movies are the same thing. And so they would give this prize to the whores that were particularly good at, at, at sucking dicks, you know. And from time to time we would see, ah, this, this actor is Artisti Populit. And they would have also Artisti Mary Tour, which was a step towards this one, Artisti Populit. Artisti Populit, uh, not everybody had this, you know. Uh, means that they were, it was like a, a really good porn actor, you know. Sucking dicks, you know. And so, what happens is uh, nothing has changed, guys, because uh, this is the honorary titles that they give to in Albania today, guys. You can see the octagon everywhere. I mean, why? Why? There's a goat here, guys. Which this uh, and the pentagram upside down, the pentagram, guys. It was not enough to put just one pentagram. They wanted also the upside down one. And the goat, guys, the goat wears this uh, very heroic figure in Albania, Skanderbeg, which was a mercenary, guys, who just killed for, for reptilians. Uh, but according to them, uh, he freed Albania from the Turkish invasion. Uh, look at the octagon everywhere, guys. Everywhere. Why? If you ask Albanians why, why there is this eight-pointed star, you know, the Ishtar... Yeah. Double headed eagle again. These are the modern ones that they give to the particularly good uh, cocksuckers. These are the modern ones. Uh, what I showed was an old one. And so, I'll end now with uh, with this bit that uh, in his last video, Gar uh, Barricade Garage did, which talks about this horse, because th that's why I'm linking uh, this to this horse of our this kind of people you know and so let's uh, let's hear this he's talking about football and how pathetic you know is people that still watch this shit you know of these actors these puppets you know of propaganda because I say fuck football yes they was like yo you know football season you know what time it is I'm like nigga you still watch that shit and then more football players are just gonna complain about more and more things as if they aren't slaves you niggas are literally cheering on slavery that's slavery and you niggas pay your tickets you buy your jerseys you eat your popcorn and you sit in front of a tv and you watch and then you cheer like bitches it's slavery I don't give a fuck how much money they make. Them people have sold their lives away. You know, that's a contract. When you make that contract, there's certain things you can do and certain things you can't do. You know, legally, they can make all their players get vaccinated. They can tell you what to do, what not to do, how to eat, how not to eat. What shows you can do, what advertising you can do, fucking monkey. Like some fucking monkeys in tights. With tired ass pants go out there on the field with they ass out. 
Who am I going to tackle today? <laughs> so, guys, <coughs> I wanted quickly to go because I, 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 this uh, program that I have here, application, just mixes shit out. It's nothing I can do about it. So, these are the horrors, guys, that, uh, that uh, you know, I showed you this, guys, with the artistic pop with the Albania, you know, just to tell you guys that nothing has changed. Uh, they use puppets in Albania. In communism, they use puppets now. These people are total slaves. But yet the sheep sees them as ah oh, powerful people. These are whores, guys. These morons have no idea what 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 they are writing. His. Do you want to 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 wear this shit? Yes, I'll wear it. These people are demons, guys. They have sold their souls, guys. And in fact, you know. The price to pay for that, these people, you know, will even get vaccinated and everything. Oh, do you want me to get vaccinated? Yeah, no problem, man. Well, their uh, their um, a view uh, is uh, is they cannot see clearly because I uh, cannot find the words in English uh, because the money is in front of their eyes and so they cannot see clearly. So uh, the bad Taliban are bad guys with a 9/11 here in your face and uh, a 666, which one six is upside down. Here's a Taliban again, guys. So let's show you some more theater while we are killing you. And I wanted to show you guys that Marcel the whore, which is this guy here, well Gucci. The guy on the with a New York uh, Yankees hat, uh, Marcel the whore, met another uh, slave like him, Totti, which is this guy here. And now I will move this other guy here. This other guy here, guys, is another sold out that here in Rome. Uh, oh, the hairs of this guy looks like perfect for my head. That's Let's play a little. <laughs> Here. L looks like I have back my hairs again, guys. Yeah. <laughs> so. So, first of all, Gucci, guys. The joining of the, of the two slaves. Slave one, that just ran faster than anybody. And this other slave here, which is a soccer player. Now it doesn't play anymore, but here in Rome it, it would seem like God, guys. In fact, they will call him uh, like Caesar, like the Emperor of Rome. Talk to you guys here in Rome. The sheep, guys. And so, the slaves had to meet to to keep the the morons uh, uh, occupied with something. You know? And so here are uh, with with their wives. Beautiful, beautiful people, guys. So let, here are the wives again, guys. Oh, wives, wives. There's one man. Very nice. Look at one man. There's woman. <sighs> Look at the eyes of this moron here. And here's the puppet, the soccer player. They told him, take your beautiful wife. And your children, and we want to take a picture. Yes, I will obey. That's it, guys. See you on a next one. Let's try to stop this.